you know, riding on coattails. You know, there's a certain Latino in the community who, you know, the second he thought that, like, everyone else was, you know, losing the limelight. And, you know, he jumped on the, like, the new popular thing. And then that new popular thing turned out to be into pee. And so he tried to backpedal really hard. Gee, chat, chat, who am I thinking of at this moment? Who am I thinking of? The name's on the tip honest, of my tongue. I completely forgot he existed. <laughs> That's why I was like, Salvo's Italian, not 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 Hispanic. John. Like, <laughs> it's too early for this. Too, too early. It's too early. <laughs> uh, let's see. That, that, Morning, Zyli. Yeah, Zyli, how you doing? How you doing, Zyli? We're talking about your 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 best friend, your comrade. Edwin generations, homeboy Edwin guys, the rat Edwin, <laughs> dude, dude, I, I, I love, I love how Edwin's trying to play Mister Nice Guy now. I, I, I absolutely love it. You know, it, it's not, it's totally not one hundred percent like a, a, a safe face moment. Not at all. No, <laughs> no, not Edwin generations, guys. Come on. <laughs> Mr. Me Too, he didn't he didn't totally know about all these girls, you know, and apparently uh, if we are to believe the allegations that were just brought up, he 100 percent knew about one of them because he was in the situation and, you know, he doesn't say anything until it becomes popular to. Of course, of course, Edwin. Now I see why you, you succeeded so much with the Onision stuff. After all, your your moral standing it's it's so it's so great it's so great, guys. <laughs> I don't have any cocktails, you silly goose," says Riveter. That may be true, but I I gotta attach myself to something, man. Come on now, I'm cl I'm a clout goblin. But yeah, we got this little we have, we have a l a little clip here. Uh. Uh, that was partly done by uh, Nicholas Durario and partly done uh, by by Tipster. Oh no, I'm linking my own DMs, guys. Oh, you see all my links to the show. Oh no. <laughs> all right, so this is about six minutes long. Uh, all right, listen. So my homie Edwin. Let me been... uh, let me pause that real quick. So okay, guys. So instead of enjoying the New Year's with his family. Edwin does a terminally online thing and does a live show while his family is in the next room celebrating New Year's, okay? You know, judge me all you want for all my terminally online decisions, but I, I have to I have to say that takes the cake. What what do you think, Squatchin? Pretty much. I'm I'm still trying to wrap my head around it because I'm asleep most of the time, it seems. Every time something happens, I am resting peacefully in my bed yeah uh, let's see when when is edwin not playing mr nice guy coffee coffee and bong rips enjoy these morning streams yeah exactly exactly coffee and bong rips that's exactly how you need to spend the mornings here if i have a bong right wake now and bake. <laughs> wake and bake yeah wake and bake guys wake and bake but yeah we got we have a little clip here let's listen to it kind of a cocksucker to everybody for the last couple months all right and um he not Edwin Generations. He wouldn't do that. After all, there aren't allegations of him being gay by a certain creep show art. <laughs> he wouldn't. He wouldn't mm. do that. He realized that he was wrong. The show was right. He realized that he he bet the wrong horse after Salvo made someone drink pee and made feces sculptures out of their own poo. Of animals. <laughs> um, and Edwin That's the, as soon as that happens, you 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 you, you know you got to get out. <laughs> Realized that I was his real friend all the way through. Okay, so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna watch we're gonna watch Edwin grovel for me. We're gonna watch Edwin get on his hands and fucking knees and. No, I'm, I'm sure I'm sure Nick is exaggerating here. I mean, come on, come on, Edwin generations, a hundred uh, like an over hundred k subscriber. You. Subscribe to YouTube channel. He he wouldn't grovel to someone like Nick, right? No, not not That's not at all. This ha the, the, this 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 has to be false. Lick my fucking feet. 
like the troglodyte that he is. All right, we're going to watch him. We're going to watch him fucking tongue punch my fucking toenails, okay? You guys want to watch Edwin tongue punch my toenails? Watch this. Watch this. Nick always wins because Nick is optics guy. He's always gonna win. Look, look, and he look. Nick, Nick is still in chat. See, is Nick is still in chat. Okay, I don't he's know looking. Nick. He's looking for his best friend, guys. He's got to make sure his best friend is still in chat. Nick is still in chat. I'm not seeing him Slide technically, but okay, he's still in chat. Of Nick. Okay, Nick, it's not a bad thing that you are the commentary arbiter, bro. That's a comp. It's not a bad thing, even though I was in a debate. Uh, I was in a debate with on my stream with you, Salvo, and Keemstar. We when we were trying to gamp on you about it <laughs> again, but it's not a bad thing, Nick. Even though I tried to gamp on you about it. Compliment, okay. The fact that someone is saying you always win is because you know what the fuck is up, okay. And look, I appreciate you, by the way, Nick. Nick. Can I just say though, like on a real level, motherfucker? I feel like you and I. On a real level, guys. On a real level. Yo, can I say on a real level? I appreciate all of you guys. <laughs> on a real level. On a, a real level. Even when you give me shit give on me Twitter, which I think you misunderstood me. Nick and that's so fine. Hot. I get lost in those ocean blue eyes. Okay, Zai's hearing aid. <laughs> okay, that's kind of a weird donation. <laughs> okay, Nick and chat types. I am Edwin's yeah. daddy again. You were never my daddy, bro. I mean, I thought we were, I thought we were bros, but you, you want <laughs> What? What? You you were never my daddy, Nick. Nicholas Diorio, even though he hears me trying to grovel so that way I can be back in the cool group again. Commentary like Jerry Mafia. G Don like Diorio. Yeah, like Jesus, like what what Edwin's doing right now is the equivalent of like what small commentary channels do. It's like Nick, Augie, please give me the attention I deserve. Please, Turkey Tom, watch my video. I'm a really cool YouTuber. I just haven't been discovered yet. Please, please share my channel, guys. But but yeah yeah don't don't be like Edwin, guys. Don't be a massive loser. I'm pretty sure. I was watching Edwin at the time of him sucking on Augie's toes in 2020, right around the the, the Chris Hansen stuff. Ah, uh, you see, I, I missed Augie. the whole Chris Hansen arc, so I really would have liked to like to have seen how. Uh... Oh, you missed the fucking show! Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> Want to be my dad? It's kind of weird. I appreciate you, bro. I know. I know. There's like a part. <laughs> I appreciate you. I appreciate you, Nick, even though I tried to jump ship and talk crap about you. I I appreciate you. And look, look, I'm not saying this is the commentary community. You don't have to kiss everyone's butt, obviously. But it's pretty I think it's pretty clear when someone's trying to jump a ship because you view someone as less as less popular or less valuable than someone else. I'm just saying, guys. I'm I, I'm I'm just saying. Part of you that wants to come off sarcastic. I don't know if you were here in the very beginning, but in the very beginning of my show, I played this uh this part of my uh, this part of the Augie. I didn't watch Augie's full show, but I, I I was in there for a little bit, and I heard you talk about how like I feel bad for Edwin because he's catching so many L's this year. I'm like, yes, thank you. And I don't know. I I I like to think that part of you meant that speech because. You're right, dude. Like, yes, I've caught a lot of fucking L's. I'll own it. Then like, here's the thing, like... I've caught so many L's because of you, Nick. Please, please take me back. Nicholas DiOrio, please take me back. <laughs> uh, what are we saying here? From the heart. Yeah, from the heart, guys. F that donation. Yeah, yeah, exactly. F that donation. Yeah. Look, look, we, 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 you know, every now and then we joke on, we, like, I, I, I've, I've made jokes heads highly, but hey, guess what? I didn't jump on, dude, this is the funny thing, like, me, me and Riverdale, for some reason, me and River are always, like, uh, not by anyone, like, that matters, but, like, a bunch of smallies, a bunch of, like, irrelevant viewers try to say that me and Riverdale were part of the Salvo news team because we said, hey, 
don't dox him and don't flag him. Apparently, that means we're automatically part of the Salvo News team. And apparently, that means we were 100% for everything he ever did. New News to yeah. me, I guess. <laughs> look, look. All I'm saying is you didn't see me do what Edwin's doing. I'm I'm just saying. I'm 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 just I'm just saying. Literally I was telling um Mina, who you guys know is my ex-girlfriend. She's one of my best she's best friends. She's I love her. She's great, you know? Like owning else is like the best thing you can do, because then that means you just willing to grow. And like dude, I own so many fucking else. Yes, I lost tens of thousands of fucking dollars on crypto. Yes. I'm glad uh, that's not something you admit. Pause for a second, John. <laughs> <laughs> the point of taking the L is to learn and grow from the L. If you're making the same L over and over and over again, are you mm -hmm. really growing? No, not as at a all. Person? I don't think so. Let's see. Dmax says, "I like how he's somehow making making up to uh, all the L, only up all the Ls. Another L, yeah. Exactly." yeah <laughs> by, the, by the way guys if you want to join uh the disc if you want to join the discord uh i did send a link to, i did send the link to it but i will post it again because i don't have it pinned yeah riveter you didn't you didn't know this people were trying to say that me and you were part of the salvo news team man yeah it was small dick pic yeah <laughs> it was yeah it was yeah it was a it was an <laughs> you guys are obviously uh gay opping yeah exactly we're, we're gay opping hi john hi everyone still have red code snowstorms jesus oh that's right you in switzerland Save land Canada. of ice one of them it's pretty cold here today too Not oh yeah yeah i got i got a canadian in this call <laughs> brr brr <laughs> they don't say a bra they say brr brr, brr. <laughs> Nick remembers that. It's my L, man. And number one, yes, dude. And I, I like Salvo for a number of reasons. Not the ones he's fucking crossing over lines here, you know. Nick, a brave stance coming from Mr. Me Too guy. A brave stance. Look, guys, I'm just saying that stuff Salvo's doing not cool. It's not cool what Salvo's doing, guys. I know it's a hard take to have. But trust me, guys, it's not cool. I appreciate you, bro. Like, Cause I was saying earlier how like, I feel like I lost friends, I lost credibility, I lost viewership because of- Wait, wait, sorry, Edwin. I met Keemstar and I think he's a, a decent dude. Okay, like he, he's- He's a nice guy, he's a nice guy. That Keemstar, he's a nice guy. He's a nice guy because he's got big numbers and you don't want to piss him off. Oh no, not at all. And plus he's got, not only does he have the numbers, he's got the money too. I mean, I wouldn't want to make, make that dude mad. I'm not gonna pull Tommy C. <laughs> I'm not gonna pull Tommy C and waste that opportunity. <laughs> dude, dude, imagine, imagine Edwin doing like the keemstar suck up show <laughs> like you know Ke keem you know you know i could totally be the new co-host of your show man i think we got a good dynamic actually i could totally see him doing that but how long would it last well it'd be very boring because like you know say what you want like with the sabo with, with sabo at least there was conflict edwin would be like well yeah yeah you, you're right keem you're right you're right the mr keem man show <laughs> It's like a, a a normal guy when you meet him, right? But on the internet, he kind of likes Edwin to treat doing people like they're toys and like flash them around. He giving the guac guac. Like, bro, what the fuck? Pay Where's attention to this man. part. You knew we talked in private. You knew everything. But Come on, man. We were talking in the DMs. We were friends. But like, when, in, in your show, you present. Where was that, Edwin, when Keemstar was attacking me? And like, you presented me like. Ed was this Me Too guy, and he's just staying as quiet. Like, bro, what the fuck? That's kind of fucked. I wish because it's true. It's true, and you, you, you probably you you knew about some of it at the very least. You knew about some of the girls, you know, and you didn't say mm -hmm. stuff until it was popular to say stuff, man. I'm I'm just saying. I'm just saying. First post salvo, Edwin was in my corner when Keen went after me. Oh no! Oh Nick. Bro. Oh, Nick, no. Oh, my God. Nick. No, Nick, you don't. I was always Nick. in your corner. I was always in your corner, Nick. Bro. Oh, 
Oh no, Nick! I was not like around. Like I was fucking users. I I I I I I I I wasn't around, guys. I I just wasn't around. Uh, man. Fucking like you know I was MIA. I was barely around on. He was in the call. Fine, but look, and I I. Not, I don't want to build beef with Keem, but bro, you should see the. I don't want to build beef with Keem. Okay, 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 Mr. Edwin. Okay, Mr. Generations. Because he'd come for your play button. Yeah. <laughs> and win. Uh, let's see. You can't. Oh, um, I mean, I mean, uh, scuffism. You're, 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 you're kind of spoiling the show later on. But, but you say, uh, you can't spell pizzle without the L. I mean, you're not wrong. You're not wrong there, but you know you you you, you gotta save that for later on in the show. I'm 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 just saying, I'm just saying, you gotta save that for later on, buddy. Text he sent me. I should see the text. Oh no! Oh no! The texts. What is Keem oh, Star said behind my back? Oh, he's gonna DM me later. Chat. What was the text? What am I? Okay, okay, and the joke is, uh, the joke is it wasn't anything that major. It was just like, lol, Nick loser. Something, something, something along those lines. But guys, yeah, don't, don't trust Edwin, don't trust G Edwin Generations ever, okay? Because he's just a slime, like the, the, the notion, the donation sound that, uh, Nick has. Slimy weasel. Nick, I did not eat the cheese, I swear. <laughs> um, how did, how did he... Um, let's see. How did the same thing to tips to Tippy on the subject of bringing up a uh, up resolved combos? Yeah, yeah, exactly. He did the same exact thing to Tipster. Uh, when it was when when it was popular to crap on Tipster. Okay, and look, uh, look, look. Hot take. Okay, Tipster kind of did part of that to himself. I think J just the way he generally responds to things, Tipster definitely could have handled some situations better. Okay, that's that's my take on it. But you know who who was the one to who was the one who had Salvo on his show uh talking mad smack about Tipster's wife and then you know like was real quiet about it and you know was joining in on the whole all the, on the laughs ha 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 and like now is like like Tipster why can't we be friends again Tipster why can't we be friends again Jeez, More Jesus importantly, God. when Shannon was going after Edwin, who had Edwin's back? Tipster, I believe. Everyone had Edwin's back. Pretty much everyone had Edwin's back and was shitting on Creepshow. Yeah. And then for Edwin to turn around and not offer the same courtesy to his quote unquote homies is it, Oh yeah, not even the it, it not even the Shannon right thing. He was getting flack for um I mean and granted everyone admitted that this was his fault, but like all like the Onision crap that was going on, right? But they were still in his corner somewhat during that. Mm-hmm. And like dude, trying to give him the benefit of the doubt and of yeah. course Chris Hansen's a snake in himself and he Yeah and did the things yeah 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 <laughs> look look S S Savo I mean not Sa Savo uh Edwin look look I get it you wanted to hop on a popular trend while it was cool you know man I, I get it you know as a small as a small content creator I get the desperation you know especially since you haven't done anything on your main channel everyone doesn't want to watch your extremely long streams besides your diehard fangirls you know I, I i get it man you want to expand your horizons you want to get that edgy audience because you know you you didn't quite get that from augie like you thought you would and so you're jumping on the salvo train hoping to get some of those red bar fans i i get it man i i, I really do i i get it but here's the thing you got to be smarter when you play the game, man. Even I know that. You know, like at least, you know, give it a year to see if the Salvo if to see if, if to see if Salvo's really going going to, you know, stay around, you know, before you completely backstab your old friend group. You know, just as you, you had to see if there was longevity in it, you know? You, you got to play smart. But that's not all with the Edwin stuff. Uh Tipster Tipster made a little thread. And you know, I w I wish I could do the cholo voice. Uh, it'd be extremely cringe if I if I did it. But here we go. Edwin, degenerate, <laughs> burn the bridge. 
with people who actually had his back on numerous occasions. So he could suck face with Savo piss cakes and ride his coattails. And he wants to talk about Mexican on Mexican crime. And uh, I don't believe we've heard this clip, but let me let me watch it. Yeah, people were actively clipping this as it was going on live. It was great. That's why you want to end it? I'm sorry. Fucking what? Fuck off, man. Let's fucking burn that fucking tipster bridge because that was my original plan, right? Like either fucking oh. call in or be a fucking pussy, man. I don't give a shit, man. That was my original plan. Tipster is such a lame dude. Like... Dude, dude, no one besides your diehard fan base thinks you look cool here. Not even, dude, not even the Salvo fans think you look cool here. Because guess what? You're trying to run. You're trying to run after their Lord and Savior gets called out. All right. How we doing, everyone? It's episode 17 of Nerdy in the Morning. My God. Okay. So... <laughs> Uh, this is going to be some fun today, folks. We got an update on several stories, uh, the Logan Paul story and the Edwin story in particular. And, uh, guys, okay, so a bit of a backstory, right? Uh, if you didn't see it, Tommy landed the Salvo interview. Now, I'm not really interested in the Salvo portion. However, Edwin did call in. Uh, originally, <laughs> uh, luckily, it was clipped. it was clipped for us. Uh, look, uh, I know uh, this is this is from the uh, the Kino account. Look, I know people like have problems with this account, but I'm using it purely for the clips. Okay, I don't really care about the guy's actual opinion or anything like that. I just care about the clips. And so, <laughs> what's funny is. Edwin, Mr. Me Too, uh, the guy who's, who's like, believe all victims, you know, the guy who always covers uh, these serious allegations, the guy who, who went after Onision. You know, as soon as the stream starts, it starts calling um, his accuser so many awful things, by the way, calling her a clout chaser, uh, saying that she... Uh, <laughs> was a whore yeah it's um very lovely i love how when it's turned on edwin it's uh you know it's no longer believe all victims you know it's just you, you know oh, this girl's just trying to get the cloud off me if you guys remember edwin was pretty open about hooking up with a fan of his and that was babs he was honest about hooking up with a fan and he didn't expect this to happen. Look, I'm not saying if Babs is is uh, lying or not, but I'm just saying when you open yourself up to hooking up with fans, especially in the online community that is commentary, you open yourself up to so so many strays. Showing someone should mail Edwin some mouth mouthwash. Uh, yeah, I'm, well, he wouldn't use it. You know, <laughs> he, he wouldn't use the mouthwash. But yeah, here we go. Uh, Nicol Nicholas got Edwin to crack under interrogation into admitting to a threesome with, with Savo and Babes on Tommy's stream in an impressive 6 minutes and 20 seconds. Babs was in Tommy's chat suggesting she was too drunk to consent. Interesting. Interesting. Let's uh, let's watch this, shall we? You know, I'll say hi to Nick. What's up, Nick? My own hype when Tommy was saying that I'm such a scary person, but apparently everyone is scared of me. Um, <laughs> no, it's <laughs> little, 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 You know, because like Edward's usually like, oh, he's like the perky guy. He's he's the perky guy, <laughs> and. <laughs> And you know he's like he's just usually he's just he tries to be like the 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 shit stirrer you know and and you know he's as soon as as soon as Nicholas Stereo gets into the call he's real quiet real real quiet. One thing up, um, so I I don't know it's like dodgeball in here with questions all night. Um, 
I guess Xylee's question to you, Edwin, is if you were like part of Salvo's cheating, why did you go and say that he had like such a loving relationship with his wife and stuff like that? I, I don't really understand that perspective because well, like the... it's your you're privy to things that you did with Salvo, right? But both could be true. Like, like, what is he saying? No, no, no. So he went on saying, like, I didn't know Salvo cheated. He had a loving relationship with his wife. So that's pretty clearly. Even though he, the day before the stream, admitted that he had a three-way with him, which is weird that, you know, you would admit to that and then say, I didn't know he was cheating. If Edwin's involved with the cheating. Is that my direct quote? Like, I need to see what I actually said because I don't know that I said I didn't know that he cheated, and he had such a loving. You said you didn't know about the cheating multiple times. Yeah, in your defense, you did have a few drinks. Um, yeah, I had a lot of drinks, and like I'm saying, my hard line was the sex thing, like the fans. Listen, guys, I was, I had a few martinis. Okay, you can't blame me. <laughs> I, I had a few martinis. You, you can't blame a guy when he's got a few martinis in him. Okay, okay, guys, I had a few apple teenies and. <laughs> You can't blame me, okay? Um, Nick, uh, Nick, uh, oh, Nick is not one that they lie to, lol. Uh, you, you think that they would learn from the Johnson situation. True, especially Edwin. You think he would learn from that. <laughs> you think he would learn. Uh, let's see. Need to mail him a booty peg? Oh, no. Oh, no. Matt was right. It was the kiss of death. Yeah. It was the kiss of death that ruined what little remained of Edwin's career. <laughs> and stuff. I definitely yeah, said but that okay, so that's sexting fans is like pretty cringe, but like actual like physical sexual activity is a lot worse, right? I guess in terms of marriage, right? Yeah, in terms of marriage, sure. So if he was physical with you in any way, wouldn't that be the cheating? Why would you go on stream and say that's not the case? Well, we kissed on camera. Wait, I'm sorry. Or, or, uh, wait, okay. <laughs> what is the public narrative versus the private one? Maybe I'm like fucking this up right no, now. No, we did not. What are you do, talking about? We we didn't do anything physical besides the kiss on the camera. What do you mean? Yeah, they didn't do anything, guys. Even though Edwin already admitted it, they didn't do anything, guys. No, they did. They didn't do anything at all. None. None. Not nothing whatsoever. Also, good morning, mysterious Kate. Good morning, Hannah Animal. Please, please say you got the clip of Brantley asking him. I do not have the clip of Brantley asking him. Uh, Hannah, if you could DM me that on Twitter, I would love that greatly. Being drunk excuses you from everything, obviously. True, true D-Max. You know, I once punched a guy. My excuse was, sorry, man, I was drunk, you know? I punched, punched a guy, uh, caused him to have a broken nose, you know, had to go to the hospital. And when the police asked me what happened, I was like, sorry, bro. I was drunk. Free of charges. In fact, they charged him for bothering me. So, yeah, clearly, like, if you're drunk, you know, it excuses everything. <laughs> or, what, what do you mean? Am I reading? Wait, I'm so... Wait, okay, so you're going around talking about this bab stuff, and you wanted to tackle that on stream, and you're running two different stories? What's That's not what you said story? to me 30 minutes ago. That's not what you said to me 30 minutes ago. Ooh. 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 Mr. Edwin caught lion. Caught lion. Ooh, uh, play this. Okay, okay. Let me, let me get this. Okay. Um, there okay, is yeah. a point, though, that you did skip over from Brantley, though. She says that you helped him cheat, and you'd known for a good minute. I helped him what? You helped him cheat, Brantley says. What do you got to say to that? Um, look, if she's gonna try to throw me in the bus, like, dude, Savo literally, like, tore, like, he knew. He knew about Savo way in September when that happened. Like, Kim already admitted to that. Like, what? Don't, don't try to do anything to me, girl. Please. Well, if, I, if you're gonna throw me in the bus, I'm gonna throw you under the bus. Real man of integrity here. Mm, anyway. Okay. Kim knew about the shit since September. And, you know, like, what? That didn't really answer that, Edwin. Um, when they... That didn't answer me. I didn't help him do anything. I didn't help him do anything, girl. 
Do not victim blame me. I'm a victim. I am I'm now just, I'm, a I'm a victim. He said it right there. I'm a victim of salvo pancakes. I just want to get the right response. I don't. I don't want you to answer this. I'm a victim. Question. I'm a victim of salvo. I'm officially a victim of salvo. I'm officially a victim of salvo. You heard that correct, folks. I'm officially a victim of salvo. Says Edwin Generations. Homeboy Edwin. Alright, you said you weren't a victim earlier. I'm officially. I'm officially victim, guys. I'm officially victim of Sal. You have nothing. Pancakes. You have nothing, and you are gay. You have nothing, and you are gay. Yo, thank you for the subscription to the channel. Thank you so much, Kim B. Also, hi, Huggy. How you doing? Edwin and Savo hooking up was not on my bingo card. Yeah, guys, uh, turn out this and Okay, say what you want about creep show art. Turns out, she was right the entire time. Edwin was in the closet. I mean, Edwin... I'm, so, I'm, I'm sorry, you know. I, I, you know, I understand you guys are homies and, you know, all that. But here, here, here's the thing. You don't get gayer than hooking up with a dude, you know, just just from my own personal experience. You know, that's kind of like the gayest thing you can do. Um, yeah. What's the second story? What did you say to you 30 minutes ago, Nick? What did I say 30 minutes ago? Wait, I'm so confused. Hold on. I wrote, wait, I'm so confused. Wait, wait, I wrote you and I said, is Keemstar lying about you hooking up with Salvo? And you said no. At his house is true. Oh my God! No, guys. At his at his house, it was true. I'm a victim of Edwin. Edwin's a victim of being dumb. You have nothing. Yeah, exactly. You have nothing, and you are gay. <laughs> my favorite new soundbite. I'm gonna keep that as a dono sound for quite a while until I find a funnier sound. Shannon was right. Yeah, yeah, guys. Creepshow Art was right this entire time. You know, personally, I think we should allow Shannon back in the community. I, I think I, th I think it would be interesting to hear her current response to things. <laughs> Salvo didn't no, deny that in the that. beginning. Okay, no, we didn't hook up. Okay, there was a night with with uh, with with Babs, but that's not. There was a, there was there was a the night with Babs. Okay, okay, I can't believe I have to explain this. You don't get gayer than hook it up with a dude. Facts, yeah, yeah. Okay, let me let me let me lay down some stuff for you. If you decide to do a threesome, and it's let, let's assume you're a guy, right? It's it's you, a girl, and another dude. Okay, while you while you're both uh, tag teaming on her. And you're not me. Maybe you're not like doing anything directly to each other. Uh, I just just want you to know that you are technically hooking up with a man. You so yeah, you would you would be semi responsible for some of the cheating, Edwin. I'm just just letting you know <laughs> you're not a victim. Augie's, please don't come out looking looking up with nick yeah 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 guys we can't we can't look look it look it's really bad for commentary community i've heard of gay ops but this is ridiculous yeah here, here, here's the thing guys here, here's the thing um we can't have gay people in the commentary community okay we already have enough trans people as it is look look there's me uh there's scuffism uh, i think we have a few lesbians here and there but you know, I think we're we're at maximum capacity. Okay, we can't let any more gays into this community. And I'm sorry, Edwin, you're one gay too many. So I, you know, pretty pretty clear sign that Edwin has to go, not because of anything like of any rap behavior or anything, but you know, just just because, uh, <laughs> just because, because you know, I just we can't have gay people here. You know, it's not me and. Salvo directly. Wait a minute. He told you 30 minutes ago. I said, are you ago, hooking up with Salvo? You said, at the house is true. What are you talking about? At the house is true. Yeah, you, can't, you can't get around that, buddy. You, you can't get around that. Uh, it's only gay if the balls touch. Your third... 
you're one third responsible. Literally one third responsible for for what's going down. I was referring to whatever I was listening to at the time of I don't know, maybe I answered mix, but I'm listening. What the what, fuck are you talking Jesus. about, dude? What, Sabo was, Nick. what Nick. Sabo was answering to was what happened in the night at Team Star's house. What, Team Star so, told me that you told him that fucking you and Salvo had like that you sucked Salvo's dick. No, so I asked you what? If that That's coming from Team Star's mouth, by the way. And I, I, I you know, I'm you know what? I'm inclined to believe Keemstar. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You've met the quota? Yeah. <laughs> Bruh, lol. There, there, there's no more letters left. Yeah, we, yeah, we've all, we, we, we're at maximum capacity. So I, I, I think we're, we're good on the gay people. We're good on the gay people, guys. <laughs> that was the case. And you said yes. Can you no, bring that, that, Nick? That I love the screenshot. Maybe I'm wrong. I'll apologize right fucking now if I read Nick, this wrong. Nick. Oh no, Nicholas Diario leaking DMs. Right. I love right. the screenshot. I just sent it to Matt. I'm really right, fucking confused. Send it to me. Send it to me. I'll put it on. My dick was right never now. sucked by anyone. Anyone. <laughs> you, and you just hear Sambo in the background. I I did not have sexual relations with that woman. One. All right. What is happening? What's going on? What's going on? I see this shit. All right, we'll put it on. Here it comes. Three, two, one, action. Is Keemstar lying about you guys hooking up with Salvo? Um, I talked with her on the phone last week. This is Edwin. And was so annoyed, I began recording it 20 minutes in. Record wow, record recording a phone call, Edwin? Recording a phone call. Really, Edwin? Also, morning, maggots. How you doing today? Re really, Edwin? Leave the gay jokes to me and John. True. True. Uh, as gay authorities, we are the only ones allowed to... Well, you know, um, half gay. But still. Recording says 20 minutes. She well, says recording. She insists... This? Um, Jesus Christ, Nick. Well, she yeah. said that he said that you he's sharing it because he said you told him something different. I, give, I mean, I didn't want to. I, yeah, maybe I should have cut more on that, but I didn't want to cut the middle of the message. But I, I mean, if you need me to give more for the other shit, feel free. You can define where it goes. Nothing, and stop. no mention of that respect. She's always been a cloud whore, and everybody ever always been a cloud whore. Always been a cloud whore, says Edwin Generations. Since no, uh, at his house, it's true. Savile did deny that in the beginning. So did you guys have sex or not? In the beginning, oh. you asked Salvo about a night at Keemstar's house. That's what I'm, I'm, I'm responding to. Uh, uh, I'm responding to that, Nick. I thought you, I thought you were mentioning something else. I, uh, yeah. Tommy looks so confused. I would be too, man. T like, I, I don't blame Tommy here. I'm, I'm right with him, man. <laughs> it's insane. It should not have been that. <laughs> Nick was watching along, and I was answering, yeah, no, like, that- These are the alleg- Dude, imagine if, like, allegations like this happened in the 2016 era of commentary. The insane content we could have gotten from it. But, instead, like, okay, someone needs to make, like, a video- a video on this. Not just, like, a stream highlight, or, you know, what I'm doing, or what Riveter's doing. Someone needs to make a- like an actual video on this because this is too juicy uh, he's not lying about that so you, you did have sex with salvo or some kind of thing no i didn't have sex with salvo <laughs> no i i didn't have sex with salvo guys okay i had sex with the woman he was also having sex with get it right and we were in the same room but but our balls didn't touch okay so it, i didn't have sex with him okay what is, we never had Edwin and I never did anything sexual except kiss on camera. But and if it, we it, did, it, I'll it, admit it. So, so you were just taking a shower after you guys went out drinking for the night. You left your ring in the guest room. No, um, then Edwin. The, so you guys Nick, crawled into Nick, bed Nick, with the girl. Nick, that's not the same night. What's so going on? Beth, wait. Brantley and Team are talking about months prior where. Team and I went ATVing and I showered and left my ring in the shower while I was getting all the mud off me. 
that's okay. I, I I I don't understand. Like, so Edwin, did you tell anybody else that you had sex with Salvo or any no. sex or oral sex with Salvo of no. any kind? No. Are you saying Team told you that I had oral sex with Salvo? Yeah, I think that's that is what oh, he's I saying. You told me that you had. No, I never fucking told you. <laughs> I, 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 I mean, wait. So. I, I just, I don't understand then what do you what think he was referring to? Like, I feel say, like I just, like, am okay. I fucking crazy? Yeah, yeah, well, what do you think he's referring to then? <laughs> what night in particular is he gaykeeping? Yeah, yeah, little, little gaykeeping. They need to pan in on Tommy's face. Yeah, yeah, do, do a zoom in. I'm a gay filmmaker, so actually I am an expert. <laughs> Let's see, having some coffee? Good, you should be having coffee while you're watching Nerdy in the Morning. You should be having coffee. See? No, Nick, you're just you're just misunderstanding and creating your your own conclusion here. Just remember back. You, you're just misinterpreting Nicholas Diorio, okay? You're trying to create a false narrative to suit your benefit. Back to the part where Salvo described the bedroom. You know, there's this giant bed. You know, Michael Jackson style in the living room. It, uh, you know, Salvo was on one side, Baz was in the middle. I was on the other side. Like that's not me and Salvo fucking. Okay. But why are you? And, and by the way, just just I want you to listen to this Nick rant here. I, I well not rant necessarily, but like this last bit with Nick because it's just just great. You get on and stream and make a fucking video or something. Yeah, you really gotta straighten this out. Listen, but because like it's... I'm not trying to fuck you on this, but you wrote me like 30 minutes it, ago. It's, it's, it's Keemstar lying about you. you yes. to... Let me let me let me put it this way: Is Keemstar yeah, lying about you guys hooking up? Crazy. Right. So, what do you think Nick's talking about when he asked you that, Ed? What do you think, what? What do you think, like, is Keemstar, like, here's what Nick writes to you. Is Keemstar lying about you guys hooking up with Salvo? So, what do you think he's, when you say that, um... There was a hookup, but we, I didn't hook up with Salvo. So, you didn't hook up with Salvo off camera and then... Like, so what are, you, what are you admitting to here? Okay, the rumors of the threesome are true. Do you understand? That doesn't mean that the guys are fucking. Well, I hate to burst your bubble. <laughs> I really hate to burst your bubble, man. But again, you might not be like doing anything to each to each other directly. But a threesome is a threesome, my guy. You're still you're still doing stuff. Okay? It says a lot of Nicholas Diorio is asking these questions like people mentioned. He's not He's not asking because he needs answers. He's he already knows the answers. Yeah, yeah. Poor Tommy. What's going on? Yeah. Wait, Salvo and Edwin are sword fighting as the girl watch. Yeah, yeah. I guess so, man. I guess so. Hey, so you had a threesome with the girl, and then you knew Salvo cheated on his wife. Now, even if you don't fucking agree that you sucked his dick, you were part of his fucking infidelity. So why go on stream and lie to everybody saying you had no fucking idea? Because because the bitch fucking begged me to keep it private. Oh, really? She begged me to keep it private, Nicholas Ciorio. By the by the way, I I I love I love how Edwin's acting. Such such an entitled little rat. Such an entitled little rat. It's a fucking recording, dude. What you don't have fuck? to say who it was, to, but you, you can say you cheated on his fucking what? wife, Edwin. You, you said his marriage is good, it's, 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 and you were involved with the sexual act that he was involved in that his wife was not involved in. That's what Nick said. Oh, I heard about some text messages. Yeah, you also watched him fuck your girlfriend, you cock. Fuck you, Nick. Man, and Ed, Edwin Big Mad. Oh, how about that? Stick that up your ass, man. I never fucked anyone. Sexual act that he was involved in that his wife was not involved in. That's what Nick said. Oh, I heard about some text. I don't know why all this stuff has to be out. Well, guess what, Edwin? If you didn't want to be involved in drama, I don't know. Maybe how? Maybe hooking up with Savo pancakes, like. I'm I'm well I'm sorry. We didn't hook up. Maybe ha ha not maybe having a threesome of Salvo wasn't the best idea. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Too close to call if it's not hooking up, lol. BRB getting tea? You're getting tea on nerdy in the morning? Edwin looks so bad. I mean Edwin's been looking bad. Edwin's been looking bad. 